Hello! I'm so excited for another month of Faith at Home. I'm so excited because it's nearly Christmas. I am so excited. I cannot wait. I've been waiting all year for Christmas and it's so nearly here. Uh, what? It's, it's, it's not quite Christmas yet, Ella. We've, we've still got a few weeks to go. No. Oh. But it's, it's Advent, so we are in the run-up to Christmas. Wow, that's so exciting. So we've got loads to do today because we've got an amazing story about sheep. Sheep? And a shepherd. A shepherd? A few shepherds, actually. And um, they go to see baby Jesus. Baby Jesus? Yes. And we are going to make our own Advent wreath because at church, for over the next few weeks, we're going to be using these to help us learn even more about our amazing God. I can't wait. Which I want to make a wreath. brings us to the theme of this month's Faith at Home video. Do you know what it is? What is it, Ella? Names of God. So, first up, we are going to hear an amazing story from Paula. I'm so excited to have Paula on this month's episode. It's going to be good. Now, if you have a sheep or a teddy, a soft, fluffy teddy at home, why don't you go and find it and you can watch Paula tell her story together. Ella, I've, I've even got a sheep on my hoodie here. Yes, you have. All right, let's get our sheep and let's, let's go. watch. Today, I'm going to be reading you a story all about the shepherds that went to see Jesus. And the story comes from Luke chapter 2, verses 1 to 20. We're just shepherds, sure. King David was a shepherd once, but we're never really going to be kings like him. We're poor, dirty, kind of smelly. We don't even get invited to parties. We're really not at all that special. But one night, one spectacular night, we got to see the most amazing thing that ever happened. We'd been seeing lots of families traveling from town to town and the cities were filling up. The emperor was taking a census and all the people had to go to their hometowns to be counted. Not us. As people walked by, they didn't even look at us. We were just part of the scenery. But this night, something was different. An angel appeared out of nowhere, right in front of us. He was blazing in a bright light. We were terrified. Don't be afraid, the angel said. I have some good news for you and it's going to make a lot of people very happy. The angel told us, yes, us, a bunch of poor nobody shepherds, that a very special baby had been born in Bethlehem, the town just down the hill. It was Jesus, the Messiah himself, the Lord, and the angel even told us where to find him. Then, suddenly, angels surrounded us, there were angels everywhere praising God, glory to God in the highest heaven and peace on earth to those with whom God is pleased, they sang. We held our breaths and soaked it all in. Then, just like that, they were gone. We looked at each other with our mouths hanging wide open. Let's go to Bethlehem we all said at the same time and we raced down the hill as fast as we could finding a baby in a manger shouldn't be too hard right after all we all know about hanging out with animals thankfully we found the tiny baby right away just as the angel said we would he was cute wrapped up in a tiny blanket and laying in a feeding bin full of hay his parents were tired, but proud. Then we praised God, just like the angels had done. When we left, our hearts were bursting with joy. Jesus' birth meant good news, no great news. We told everyone we met about this new gift that God had given the world. We couldn't stop praising God. And for the first time in our lives, we felt like somebody's. You see, God could have chosen anyone in the world 
to be the first to hear the good news of Jesus, but he chose us. A bunch of dirty shepherds, a handful of nobodies, God chose us. I guess we're not really nobodies after all. The truth is nobody is a nobody. God loves all of us. That's why God sent this special baby into the world. Jesus was a gift to every person in the world. Jesus was a gift to every man, woman and child, the most precious gift God had ever given. Have you ever felt like a nobody? If you have, just remember that Jesus was born for you. And Jesus wants to be friends with you. In fact, you can talk to Jesus right now. Just pray and he'll hear you. He was born to love you. Today we are going to make a Christmas wreath, Tim. How yes, cool is that? I am so excited. You should be too. Let's go. So in your packs, you are looking for these pages, okay? So we have one two three four five candles and then we've got some holly and some berries as well also you're going to need a paper plate so they're Whoa. they're the, they're okay. the start okay. okay okay so we need to start cutting these out too okay let's do it make sure you get some help with this that's important here we go tim can you, can you help me out, please, a little uh, bit? I'm, yeah, sure. You know what? I'm going to cut this one. Ella, this has taken a really long time. Yeah? I mean, do you not want to do it quicker? Yeah? What do you mean? Well, look, stop that. Okay. We're going to speed this up a bit. You okay. ready? And that's not just it, Ella. Watch this. Other sheet. Let's do it quick. This is amazing. Why have I wasted my time cutting all of these out? I don't know, Ella. Why have you? You don't need to. Why don't you try this at home? <laughs> oh, yes. Tim, that was really cool. But can you please just cut this last one so that people at home can see? I mean... Uh... Okay, I'm going to cut this one out, just so that you can see how to do it. So, um, first of all, you've got to be really careful with your scissors, and then uh, I'm just going to cut it out. ta -da! Ella, I have finished. Look at that. Oh, you have really made quite, quite, quite a big mess I'll just, I'll just cut it out, All right, Ella. thank you. Right, let's move all of this out of the way. So next up, Tim, we need to actually start to colour these in. Oh, I love colouring in. Right, so now we've done that, I'm going to go and get some pencils and I want you to guard the area because um, the puppets were extremely naughty last time and I don't want them to mess this up okay, more than I, you already have. I can do that, Ella. Okay. I'm going to guard the area so it doesn't get messed up. <sighs> okay. I mean, you're taking your time, Ella. I'll be back soon. Do you know that cutting out was so exhausting? I'm starting to feel a bit tired, actually. Yeah. I'm, do you know what? I'm I'm going to guard them, but I'm just going to I'm just going to sit down. Hang on, let me just. Uh, if I move this over, yeah, I think yeah, I can I can still see everything. I just I'll just sit down. I can watch it sat down. I'm watching it sat down. I'm just watching it sat down. Are you still watching, Tim? Yeah. Yeah, I'm still watching. I'm watching it. I'm, I'm still watching it.
was never what? asleep. Did you do all of this? And why is there what? paper everywhere? I, I, you aren't going to be the paper. one tidying that up. I don't know what's happened, Ella. I was watching it the whole time. Did any time. of you see who did that? I, I, I mean, I was watching it the whole Why time. Why were you was asleep? Nothing. I wasn't asleep. I told you to watch, didn't I? Right, come on. We are going to colour in all of don't our what candles now that we've cut them all out. Good we've idea. Made such a mess. Right. Well, I don't really know how that's happened, actually. Right, so again, if I colour this one, you colour that one. Are you ready? Let's okay. do this. Do you want to go first? Okay, a bit like this. Ella, that's taking you a long time. I think well, I'm going to do mine a bit faster. I'm just trying to stay in the lines and make it really neat. Well, let's give it a go, shall we? All right, if you say so. so quickly do you want to do the rest of them then uh, yeah all right let's do the rest of them i'll do these two and you can do that last one all right fine okay here we go finished how did you do that so quickly all right hang on i'm just doing this last bit then right okay so now we have got to this stage, we need to put all of our candles together, okay? Okay. So I have got some sticky, double-sided sticky tape, but if you want to use glue, that's fine. So we're gonna stick it on the edge. On that like edge that. tab, okay. On the edge tab like that. And then we need to fold all four like this. So can you do that too? So fold it across the okay, line like just that. Like that. So do you want to do I'm those? I'm going to give that a go. And then we're just going to roll it round and put it together so that it's a circle. Now, you could do this so that you have some card in there so that they stand better, or you could even wrap it around a toilet roll. So the next stage is I have a pencil and we are going to draw around each one. Draw, draw around each one? Yeah. So okay. the first one we need to do is going to go right in the middle, okay? So we're going to do a nice circle like this, right the way around. And then we need one here, one here, one here, and one here, so that they're equal things away from each other. Whoa. Okay, so next up, we are going to um, cut, in fact, I'm gonna show you. We're gonna cut like this across on each one so that it stands up. I'll, I'll show you what I mean. Okay. So just for this first one, to make the hole in it, we're going to put the glue tack in and then when we push down, perfect. That's so really we need to do that. Well, we need to do that in the, in the middle of each circle. Okay. I know. Right. So we're going to cut along these lines to the edge of the circle. Now you might need to get an adult to help you with this. You definitely will, because even I feel like I might have to ask an adult for it, help. It's looking quite tricky. It is quite tricky. I can't wait to see what this is like though when it's done. Ella, do you want some help? <sighs> yeah, I think I do. Well, Come keep, on. keep going and, All right. uh, All right. and I'm going to do you a favour, okay? Okay. Oh, thanks, that's much better. Right. So now we're going to pull them through so that it's like this. And this is so that our candles stick up. You'll see in a minute. 
So okay, we're so at this stage. We've got five holes in a plate. Now, as you can see, when now these stand on there, they 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 stand properly. You see. Oh. Yeah. So they're the four the four sections. Oh, right. Wow. What we're going to do with this now, though, is decorate it. So we've cut out some holly. So we're just going to really, really quickly colour this in and decorate this. Go. Go. Incredible! Wow, what a great idea! So, guys, in your packs today, you will have the names of God prayer. Do you remember we've been praying each month using the packs and the contents? So today we're saying the names of God prayer, which is there for you to read with me if you want to, if you want to get it out. Ruth and Ralph are going to join in as well. So, shall we pray? Father, yes, yes, yes. Yay. Father God, Father God, we thank you. We thank you for all the wonderful names that help us understand who you are. For all the wonderful names that help us understand who you are and what they all mean. And what they all mean. Thank you. Thank you that you know each of us by our name. That you know each of us by our name. That's me and you, Ralph. And that we are precious to you. And that we're precious to you, God. As we learn more about you. As we learn more about you. Help us to share what we know with others. Help us to share what we know with others. So that they can know you too. So that they can know you too. Amen. Amen. That's my favourite bit, Maggie, the amen. Okay. Thank you, Maggie. Um, uh, what's your favourite thing about Christmas? My favourite thing about Christmas is definitely fairy lights. Oh, they're so beautiful. They Thank you for helping us today. We'll see you soon. We'll see you soon too. Bye. Bye. Come on. Um, where's Tim and Ella? Have you seen Tim and Ella? Have you seen where Tim or Ella is? Um, Tim, Ella. Oh, oh well. Up next is our song, Ralph. Shall we go and sing our song? Yay! Let's go! Let them give thanks to the Lord for his unfailing love and his wonderful deeds for men. For he satisfies the thirsty and fills the hungry with good things.
Oh, oh that was so good. good. That was so good, good to hear. Good thing. All right. Oh, I love that song. I love the guitar. Tim, what was your favourite bit this morning? Uh, well, I really enjoyed making the craft. Did you? You were actually quite naughty making that craft, but no, all right. I wasn't. I'm glad I, you really enjoyed I it. I watched it really well the entire time. Yeah. I kept watch and over I everything. What's my fault? I really, thought? really loved the story. It was really nice to see Paula, but I loved the story. I loved that the shepherds went to see the amazing baby Jesus. It was so cool to hear, wasn't it? They did. It's true. Yep. And praying with Maggie and, well, just everything it's been great it's been a fantastic month now there is loads of things leading up till christmas that queens road baptist church are doing so keep in touch keep looking out for what's going on and just have the most amazing christmas we will see you in january but until then merry christmas and have a happy new year bye, bye.